Hold on. I have it. I have it. So we got T, T, and Germ. Do, do you know what? Yo, let's go. Punch it out. 10% on uh, Germ. 15. 27 from a jab. What's Can I just up, say guys? I love uh, Glen Tendo and uh, Jewel here? Yeah. Um, I totally just guessed that, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> like, I'm, I, like, I saw you on, like, some, like casting, I think, yeah. uh, at Suplex. Yeah, yeah, I think yeah. that was the first time I, like, saw face and tag. Right. Um, but I just want to say I love the fact that they're, that jabs do an absurd amount of damage in this game. Oh, my God, Compared to yeah. uh, Smash 4. Damage output in general is just humongous in this game. And yes. Venya closing out that stock with that the amazing sure fair. fair, yeah. Uh, DeBuzz, when he was picking up Greninja, asked me what did Venya do when uh, he reads a neutral getup. Because uh, what DeBuzz will do is just try to time like a grab or uh, an F smash, which is really difficult. Yeah. Uh, and Venya will 10 times out of 10 just space a fair. Yeah. It'll I mean, that move it. is really safe. It just it has a, a lot of startup, and that's where you want to you kind of want to stuff him out. Right. That's kind of the problem with Greninja is like his forward, it, when he's in disadvantage, he doesn't have a fast button in front of him. Right. You know, like a, like a Fox and Air or something like that. That's actually a really good point. It, so that's kind of where characters abuse him. But Zelda is not really the kind of character that's going to have the buttons to do that specific thing. Yeah. Um, but right there, just seeing a jump, uh, lightning kick fair. Oh, oh my. That was sour a, spot. I don't even need this sweet spot. Let's go. That was, see, that was really smart too because he was in a real hole a second ago. Like he had to go for a play yeah. like that because Zelda's not good at approaching, especially not good at approaching Greninja. Right. And she only really plays super well with a lead. And so, sometimes if you, if you watch Germ play, you'll learn, wow. Well, <laughs> I was going to say he just does things. Uh, but Venya uh, proving that he does the same. Uh, but Germ will, he, he disregards that, he, he disregards his frame data, disregards that yeah. people will consider his character like a low tier or mid tier, wow. and will just do things. Right. And then all of a sudden you're like at 60, and then that's kill, that's no, killing yeah, percent Zelda's, for Zelda. Um, Zelda's far from low tier in this game. I mean, I wouldn't say she's a high tier, but she's definitely leagues above how, where she was. And for yes. some people, there's going to be a huge learning curve fighting this character for the first time. He got Greninja with, with that small hitbox while he was crouching. Right. Are you are yeah. you kidding me? <laughs> That's insane. Yeah, I mean, what, she's one of the characters that, oh my that, god, oh again. my god, he's like, whip a move in front of me when I'm jumping towards <laughs> you, bro. So I can hit you with Hip this oh, falcon no. knee and then uh, SDing under Speaking PS2. Speaking of just doing things, I guess he just SDs too. Yeah, man. But, you know, he looked he looked like he was figuring some stuff out there. I'm impressed with the, the interactions when he right. did win. He wasn't playing he, scared. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And especially for that character against Greninja, like, you know, it feels like Zelda's designed to camp really hard. Right. So for him to, like, go, hey, I'm down against Venya, and I'm not going to be scared, and I'm going to just make plays yeah. happen, that's pretty impressive. That's kind of a trademark to yeah. his play style in general. Yeah. I feel like he's a, he's a player that just doesn't care about, like, a lot of things. Like, no hesitation? It, yeah, he'll yeah. just go for things. Right. Uh, and uh, Venya could be caught off guard. Right. I mean, that's the thing about Venya is, like, the meme of Venya is that the man doesn't hold shield. Like, he tries to yeah. use movement options as much as possible. He's been doing that. Yeah. And so sometimes if you just swing hard, like, he's going to walk into yeah, that. because he's home. He, yeah, he's not holding shield. Oh, and the counter pick to rob him. Oh, I was, oh, boy. I, I, the I echo was too fighter. slow. My I joke? was too slow to say this, but I... Uh, oh, yeah, you're going to be perfect this, for this. Let's go. Why would he do this, though? My, I, my, uh, I my, my joke is that, you know, there's... A bunch of Echo Fighters, spiritual Echo Fighters in this game. Yeah. Pac-Man, Zelda, and Robin are all the same character. No one can change my mind. You, all they have is like a, a neutral. Take. They have a special move that makes you jump, and that's how they function. They need you to jump. <laughs> and then they throw you. you. Yeah. You know what? I'm going to throw Samus in there, too. And Samus. There's a bunch. Simon and Richter or Baby Robin. There's a bunch of them. But Greninja, some of the best uh, tools to get around that, you know? Right. So, uh, see, I disagree hard with this pick. Okay. Uh, not because... Uh, Maybe Germ's Robin isn't seasoned enough, but I, I play Venya all the time. Right, he, right, right. He knows the match. He, he kn yeah, you have he to be like really well, like in tuned to do this. But he kn he knows. Like, yeah. <laughs> there's so much Germ has to figure out right now. Right on the fly. That Venya's like, bro, I'm already on tier three of like, this I matchup. <laughs> like I'm past wave one. I know like the third meta of this matchup. Uh, so we're going to be seeing a lot of Hydro Pumps offstage from Venya when he can't uh, go too far out. Because yeah. Robin can actually go, I'm not going to say deeper than uh, Greninja, right. but it can definitely make Greninja uncomfortable. Yeah, uh, they, But with yeah. that Hydro Pump there, 
It's really scary because you don't want to L-Wind at the same moment of Hydro Pump. Right. Because then you're just going to go high, and Venya and is not one to let you get back to stage Right. That. You are going to float into a down smash, guaranteed. Oh, Lord. No, oh no. wow. Getting that platform. awesome platform tech right there. That Fastball, was... please. Go. Okay. Oh, nice. That was really smart. Yeah. The defensive Arc Thunder. Right. Perfect. And put it right by the ledge, too, just to cover that, that's the area you, that he had to be in. That's what you should use it for. Don't... Don't try your, I know the, the Robin cord will be like, oh, I can do a combo with Arc Thunder. Like, no, leave it. Just Just get back defense. on stage. Yeah, right. And it does 29% oh by itself. Oh, my God. And that detail to forward See, air, man. Oh, my God. When you're in killing percent for those confirms, then you'll just go for it. And he doesn't care if you notice. Yeah. And, just, uh, and down a, lot tilt, of those, down tilt. a lot of those scenarios, especially for a character that doesn't have a great fall speed like Robin, like, Greninja's just going to be able to whiff and Did then you trap you again. Yeah, that was insane. Oh, my God. He could have neared. Wow. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Could have shipped it. Yeah, okay. they, they buffed the crap out of Robin's Elwind, and it's still yeah. a pretty easy recovery to kind of so, like, like gimp with. and mess with. Yeah, Yeah, this is going to be a super uphill battle, man. My guy is down two stocks already. Venya's super oh comfortable. Oh, my God. He actually just jumps back to the stage. That was ballsy. I think Venya yeah. wasn't ready for that. He wanted yeah. to pick another defensive option. Oh, oh, no. The Venya Dude. Classic. The Venya Classic. He's way too comfortable in this matchup. Yeah, man. That's a Venya standard, like, go into where the magnifying glass and just do the, the shadow sneak, and you're like, all right, I'm done. I, I, <laughs> I couldn't even see where he was. Like, I, I thought I was safe. Yeah. It's definitely Zawaru, There's though. no safety here, bro. Zawaru, though. The last time, of he already forced you to go low, so it was just a safe bet for him. And, and you know what? Even if he missed that shadow sneak, he still probably would have enough time to just hydro pump back to the stage and maybe keep Robin at the ledge if or even just intercept well, him. Can we see the replay one more time? I don't know if Jerm had used his second jump. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, jump. okay, so there's... All right, we're back. And yeah, he kind of just the, leaned yeah. into this. So if he would have missed the, the Shadow Sneak, he could have right. just, like, air dodged. Yeah, he was saving that jump. Uh, and punished it, because that has a lot of end lag. 